There was spontaneous jubilation by MPP supporters across the country as they welcomed the verdict of the Supreme Court on the 2020 election petition brought by John Mahama. Addressing supporters who were trooped to join the celebration at the party headquarters in Accra, the leadership of the MPP maintained that the verdict of the Apex Court only confirms the victory of Naneku Fado as a representation of the true will of the people. Manuel Kranting was at the party headquarters and has filed this report. We've been welcoming the uh, verdict of the Supreme Court of the New Patriotic Party. We've been welcoming the uh, verdict of the Supreme Court and uh, assuring the base of the party that they are going to mobilize and even deliver uh, a, a bigger win come 2024. They make the point that the NDC's defeat at the hands of the NPP is going to get worse come 2024. I believe we worked out for victory 2020. And we were confident that as a party, we secured enough presidential vote to win the presidential contest. And also secured a lot to win the parliamentary majority as well. I mean, Ugo, are, you, are you not concerned that, I mean, even though the Supreme Court says that these allegations have not been proven, they still hang there. And the, the easy did not respond to them. The EC did not, the EC chairperson did not take the stand to respond to the allegations. First of all, it is clear that you cannot compel, you cannot compel a witness into the box. In any case, the EC closed this case. That of the president's legal team and that of the NPP also closed their case. And in any case, the electoral commission was of the clear view that what the people voted for was what they declared. And once the NDC disagreed, they were entitled to legal options. Today, the matter has been settled. There's no ambiguity about that at all. Uh, Freddie Blay, Chairman Freddie Blay, for instance, made the point that um, they knew that all of the time that was spent in court was just to uh, waste the time. And this was really emphasized by the General Secretary of the Party, John Buedu, making the point that they had worked tirelessly for the victory that they had secured, as was so declared by the Chairperson of the Electoral Commission on 9th December. God, I've come to the end of what we all know as a terrible waste of time of the people of this country. Initially, they said they won the elections. Your mama won the elections. And that the election has been stolen. For Nana Adodam Kwakufuado. He was urged on by the Ghanaian people because I know that he wouldn't have gone to court. Because he knew right from the one that they've lost the election. When they were pushed by the Ghanaian people to go to court, they ended up in court saying that they didn't win the elections and that nobody won. The witnesses that they brought, the court was very charitable to two of the witnesses that their witnesses and the things they said there was fanciful. We got through the cross-examinations he accepted that Nana Adodankwa Akufuado, whether Techim and South votes were given to them or the valid votes gotten by each candidate were correctly given to them, Nana Adodankwa Akufuado got not only more than 50%, got 51% plus of the